what they wanted politically? Did they want your endorsement? Did they want you to help people get out the vote? Hey, you know, they ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just living my life like it's golden, living my life like it's golden. But, you know, I'm not going to, you know what I'm saying, talk politics, but I love the president. You know what I'm saying? She represents herself. She don't represent me. But that's the way white people see us through through our through our, our arts and entertainment because that's the, the the biggest spokesperson for us she yeah. she's again this, the biggest self again with him. this woman has a, a verse in her song where she says don't give a f about a credit score i might be rich as f tomorrow Dumbass. That's the woman that y'all that, that that don't even rhyme. I'm sorry. <laughs> it don't make sense. Well, if you, you know it's it, 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 it it like... <laughs> e um, listen, Glorilla is going viral after being asked. Oh Jesus! About her visit with Joe Biden. Take I'm about to go to me. Yeah. Biden. So wait, shall we say Joe Byron? <laughs> Joe Byron. Hey yo, <laughs> Joe Byron. That right. <laughs> we're a peanut at man. That's a peanut kid. Yeah. It's Fish Jump Podcast. Oh. Let's go. What they wanted politically? Did they want your endorsement? Did they want you to help people get out the vote? Hey, you know, they ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just living my life like it's golden, living my life like it's golden. But, you know, I'm not going to, you know what I'm saying, talk politics, but I love the president. You know what I'm saying? I love everybody. And at the end of the day, the day got to end. Listen, before I, before I pass this off to y'all, I want to know is they need to fire our whole team. The president's team who thought it was a good idea to have Glorilla represent the black community. You know what I'm saying? She represents herself. She don't represent me. But that's the way white people see us through through our through our, our arts and entertainment. Because that's the, the, the biggest spokesperson for us. She yeah. She's again, taking this, the biggest self again. With them. This woman has a, a verse in her song where she says, Don't give a F about a credit score. I might be rich as F tomorrow. Dumbass. That's the woman that y'all that, that that don't even rhyme. I'm sorry. It don't make sense <laughs> well, if you know anything. If you know anything, rhyme, like, if you know anything about credit, you know that what you're saying ain't making no sense. <laughs> don't give a f about a credit score. I might be rich as f tomorrow. That's no, what she's saying be. in the song. Like, so you, you just, like at the end of the day, it's like again they did it with Cardi B. They had her up there. No disrespect to her. I love Cardi. I love Glorilla. But they not. They should not speaking about the democratic party the republican party they should not be speaking on behalf of black and culture. i need her to keep jill scott's lyrics out her she's mouth she's like 25 Please. like jill she don't scott know got sense she don't know they should have had jill scott get up yeah. there what, what you know what well, uh, or, listen, what i'm gonna say this i i can i believe i can safely say that the targeted audience that the democrat party is trying to uh, get in touch with or trying to get out and vote aren't really voting yeah that's why they i believe i can exactly. safely say, i so believe I, I can about safely it. say that yeah if you, if you think about it the if they're trying to grasp the attention of the 20 something year olds the 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 ones that are that's just entering you know adulthood mm -hmm. they have not been um voting so yes, they're going to get her their attention through her. So now they want them as the majority to vote and pretty much vote him back into office. But I'm, a, yeah. I'm not, I'm not going to go all political on this about you know Biden and, and all that other I, stuff. Yeah. But, I mean, I agree. Um, I, you know, I agree. I'm not, but but the <laughs> at this point, if he sees that the majority of our generation is not happy with what he's doing. He knows that he's yeah, out of there. But again, the out of the out of touch democratic party having meetings with rappers. I'm sorry, trying to influence the, that generation of people who can't even probably can't even spell politics again. It's so far fetched to me. If, if you want, if you want it, if I want, if we wanted somebody to watch this pod, if we wanted young people to watch this podcast, do you think we, we should get Dr. Umar or do you think we should go get a little dirt? <laughs> Shit, I got one better for you. Sexy red. Hell no. So that's what I'm saying. If you yeah. want if you want people to watch you, you gotta know what they're watching. And again, white people or the white power structure, they think that the majority of children are sitting around, which is not the majority, but it's a good amount of them. They're yeah. listening to sexy red. Or they're listening to Glorilla. So they're going to go get them. When I was twenty one. 
what was that two in the early 2000s mm. when it was rock the vote and all that who they who they had to, who, who did they have out in front who did yeah diddy rock the oh, vote yeah, he had the sure rock the did. vote shirts and all of that yeah. he was out there do they think i was gonna listen to diddy or bill clinton I didn't care about no Bill Clinton at 22, 20. <laughs> I don't care what he's saying. Yeah, yeah. white man. No, they, 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 I'm going to take that. I take think I'm, take I'm, that. I'm, I'm, about that. To, I'm about to go liberal on this next, you know, election. Liberal? I don't yeah. know about you. I'm about to go independent. Independent, you know, independent. Republican. I'm going Africa. Look. Yeah, look, <laughs> listen, he's the African. Listen, I'm listen, just go live with listen, listen, I'm, just not I'm, I'm going to say this before we move on to the next one. If you're a blindly voting Democrat, because your obli- you feel that your Obligated obligation you is, to your, is to being a your Democrat financial class, man, you 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 a goddamn fool. And you, you got to do you got to do, do your you research. Gotta do your research. You got to do, do your research. research. Up until no uh, matter what, up until Kennedy came, the majority of black people doing well in this country were Republicans. So yeah, just do your research. Just uh, understand yeah. what the Democratic Party is. And yeah, again, stop. Yeah, stop that. I mean, as an adult, when you get older, you just don't just. Check all just, Democrat. Just check all you know what I mean? Because you know when you're young, you know what I mean. You you're impressionable. You you exactly. know, oh, and also at the same my mom's time, a Democrat. Right. My, my father's a Democrat. But then also my the other thing you gotta remember is because a lot of people don't do their research, and then when you go to the polls, they give you they them little no the, those, those papers, are. and it tells you, oh yeah, vote for all these Democrats because they'll help you. Those things are gone. Listen. Now that I'm older and paying bills. Man, I'm like, man, we need it. Let me see Uncle here. Sam, help me pay I don't my bills. Think so. Listen, we, we honestly, we need like, after you go through a bad breakup, we need a couple years off. Let's just, right. have, let's right. just not get a president at all. Like, yeah. We, just, yeah. we just all pitching together and make make stuff happen. Yeah. Cause oh, we, get, we get one bad breakup after yeah, another. Yeah, we, ba- we battered right now. We, 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 we battered. We just got to, you know. We just gotta take some time to ourselves. Yeah, I need to. I need to get to learn who yeah, I, I gotta, am. Listen, listen, <laughs> listen, man. Th- this is our choice, man. You either got a coochie grabber, or you got someone who don't even know his fucking asshole from his elbow because he just forget. He forgets everything, man. So who who you gonna choose? You got grab the pussy. You got, you got Teddy the Toucher, <laughs> or you got Dominic Dimension. Yeah, yeah, right. Dominic Dimension or Teddy the Toucher. He, oh, first of all, he should. What is the president should, should should be between forty and sixty five? That should be the new rule. No, would you want your? Would you want your? your I love my mama to death. She's seventy one years old. I do not want her running my company. I love First you, mama. All, I'm gonna take care of you forever. But Kamala no, go, go home. Kamala is supposed to be assisting him. I haven't, I haven't seen much of her. The vice president ain't never did nothing. What is, what what you, well, well, maybe she's just a figurehead. She is a figurehead. She though. is. I'm sorry, but you know, we ain't gonna go too deep. Yeah, yeah but right. you know, this joint podcast, man, we not a political podcast. Nah, man. not at all. Not we at just, all. we nope. just a talk shit podcast. We, we talk are. shit. All, El Boogie in the building, y'all. Mr. L. L. Boogie. What's up? Yeah, Shout out to Angela. everybody in the chat. El Shout out to everybody in the chat, man. You know what I mean? This John See podcast. y'all. Appreciate man. you. We, oh, man. Where we at? We are at number... We, four. We at number four? Number four. What, man? Uh, you right over there, T? I'm good. Why you ask me that? Yeah. Just make sure just, you know, when checking drinking. on you because, you know what I mean? Last week, you was, on, you was on that ish. No, last week, I was on good behavior. Mm-hmm. That's what I'll do. I think it was her that started that Dick. No, it was. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, I, I think it was her that started there. <laughs> I am such a lady. I'm too classy for that. <laughs> you know how you know many freaks I heard say that before. <laughs> I don't want to be listen, a freak, listen, but what, what, I can't look, help look, myself. Look, what's, the, what's the first thing they say before they go down on you? Uh, I normally don't do this. <laughs> Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> oh no, Diddy! <laughs> no, Diddy! <laughs> really, really, you gotta, <laughs> you gotta put my business out there like that, though. Is that your business? <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah. Now we getting some. I tell joke. you, <laughs> <laughs> that's your podcast.